This week, Triumph pulled the velvet sheets off the Triumph Scrambler 1200 Steve McQueen edition. A new beautiful and a unique limited edition that celebrates what Triumph is calling the most famous movie star, movie stunt, and motorcycle in history with the Scrambler 1200 Steve McQueen edition. Those are some pretty big words, but I'm going to move past them to get to the bike. In today's video, I'm going to run you through a list of the 14 things that I think you should know about the all new Triumph Scrambler 1200 Steve McQueen edition. Number one, inspired by the original competition spec Triumph TR6 made famous by the legendary barbed wire jump in the iconic 1963 Second World War classic, The Great Escape, McQueen chose the modified Triumph TR6 over a period correct German military motorcycle. Number two, with just a thousand Scrambler 1200 Steve McQueen edition models available worldwide, each bike is individually numbered on this beautiful billet machined handlebar clamp, which also features a laser etched Steve McQueen signature. For even greater exclusivity, each bike comes with a unique certificate of authenticity stating the bike's VIN number and carrying the signatures of Triumph CEO Nick Blur and also Chad McQueen, son of the legend himself Steve McQueen. Number three, the unique paint scheme features a competition green tank with brushed foil knee pads, exquisite hand painted gold lining, gold heritage Triumph logos, dedicated Steve McQueen tank graphics, brushed aluminum Monza cap, and a brushed stainless steel tank strap. The distinctive Steve McQueen edition will also feature the aluminum high level front mudguard as standard, which along with the rear mudguard will also be painted in competition green. Number four, in addition to the standard 1200 XE's class leading specification, the Steve McQueen edition comes fitted with the engine protection dresser bars, which adds another layer of ruggedness. Fabricated from stainless steel tubing, these have an electro polished finish and offer additional protection to the clutch and alternator cases. Number five, a laser cut and pressed aluminum radiator guard with laser etched Triumph branding also comes as standard giving additional protection from loose stones while optimizing airflow. Number six, the Steve McQueen edition also features a premium brown bench seat with stitched ribbing and Triumph branding, which further enhances the overall classic style. Number seven, the Scrambler 1200 is powered by the latest evolution of Triumph's 1200cc high-powered British twin with peak torque hitting 110 Newton meters at just 4500 RPM, while peak power of 90 horsepower arrives at 7250 RPM. New for 2021, the engine update delivers lower emissions exceeding Euro 5 requirements. Number 8. Superior stopping power is guaranteed by the category leading Brembo M50 radial monoblock calipers with twin 320mm floating disc on the front and the Brembo caliper with a single disc on the back. Such outstanding braking power is managed by the ABS that comes standard on both models. Number 9. Enhancing the multi-purpose character of the Scrambler 1200, high specification wire spoked wheels with aluminum rims and a side lace design comes as standard, allowing the use of tubeless tires. Dual purpose adventure focused Metzer Torrens tires are standard fit, while for more extreme off-road use, Pirelli Scorpion rallies are recommended as an improved alternative option from the factory. Number 10. The 21 inch front wheel contributes to the Scrambler 1200's incredible off-road capability and commanding riding position and gives great visibility ahead, both when commuting on and off-road. Number 11. Packed with the state-of-the-art technology and rider aids, the Scrambler 1200 features a full-color TFT instruments offering two different design themes, each with three different display layouts allowing the rider to alter the amount of information shown. According to the preference, the TFT startup sequence can also be personalized with the rider's name. Number 12. Triumph's latest generation ride-by-wire ensures responsive and precise throttle control at all times and enables the six riding modes. Road, Rain, Sport, Off-Road, Off-Road Pro which is only available on the XC model and a rider configurable, basically a custom. The riding modes which can be selected while on the move with the exception of the off-road and off-road pro modes adjust throttle response, traction control, and ABS settings for enhanced safety and optimal performance in all riding conditions. Number 13. 
The Scrambler 1200 XE also features optimized cornering ABS and optimized cornering traction control, both of which automatically adapt the level of intervention to maintain the optimal ride at any lean angle. These features are managed by the initial measurement unit, which measures the roll, pitch, yaw, and acceleration rates of the bike in order to calculate the lean angle and optimize braking and traction control accordingly, ensuring greater rider stability. Number 14. There is no word on pricing and availability on the new Scrambler 1200 Steve McQueen Edition model in the USA yet, but in the UK it's going to hit the dealer floor in June for £13,600 sterling, which equals about US dollars To wrap up this video, I think the Triumph has really been doing everything that they can to champion Steve McQueen over these past few years. While I'm not saying it's a waste of marketing money, I would not be the advertising guy that I am without asking the who's, the what's, and the why's of this campaign. I'm sure that there are loads of people in that 60 plus age group that idolize Steve and grew up with his name around their house, and will snap up one of these instantly. But is this bike building the brand, or is it just continuing to recycle their past? Either way, competition green paint and a brown leather seat, I'm here for it. Obviously, these are just my thoughts on the bike. Now, what are your thoughts? Do you like what Triumph has done to the Scrambler for this year? Let me know in the comments below. Now, go out there and ride safe. Bye guys.